Hello, hello, Tatum here. Get ready to sweat with this stress-reducing knockout kickboxing workout. No equipment, no squats, no lunges, but don't let it fool you. Like most of my workouts, we will build intensity as we progress through three large circuits. I will keep it interesting and fun with several exercises that will change things up as we go. We'll begin with two rounds of core strength, then two rounds of slower paced jabs, crossover punches, and kicks. To finish, we bump up the intensity with three rounds of faster paced kickboxing moves, leaving you energized, stress-free, and ready for the day. Now let's get to it. All right, hello, hello, Tatum here. Thank you for joining me. Today I have a 40 minute kickboxing joint friendly workout. That means there's no lunges, no squats, and no jumping today. This was a request by one of our members, so I'm super, super excited to bring this to this member today. And if you have any other requests, please let me know because I will bring them into our workouts and our challenges. All right, so uh, today just a towel and water bottle, absolutely nothing else, just bring it. If you can, get outside where you are and do this workout. Uh, take it somewhere fun, bring a friend along. All right, let's go ahead and get started. We're gonna go with a march in place, moving those arms forward and back. Just warming up, getting that blood moved out of the core and into our limbs today and raising that heart rate. Here we go. And I'm gonna move forward and back for fun. <laughs> I'm stuck in here in this small space, so I'm gonna move around just a bit. All right. Nice work. We're going to go into butt kicks now, okay? So just bringing that heel towards your bottom. Really kick up there. See if you can get it going. One side. I need to work a little bit on loosening up because only one side hits. But we're getting there. We're getting there. Good. Kick. Kick. Now, let's go a little slower and let's add a little bit of a squeeze here. A pullback with those elbows. There you go. You got it. Keep moving. Feels good. We're gonna have some fun. Heart rate's gonna come up today. This is very cardio based. Should have a good time with it though. Here we go. Kick, kick. All right, we're going back to those marches. But this time I want you to bring those arms up and around real big. Two, there you go. And you can march forward and back with this too. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine and 10. Let's reverse it now with those arms. Keep marching. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine and 10. Now we're going to punch with the butt kicks. There you go. Last one here. We're gonna go right into this workout. There's no rest in between uh, the exercises. So please be ready. 30 second intervals is all we have today. Six exercises. We're gonna move through this workout fairly quickly. Good, punch, kick. That's it, get those heels up. That's it, good job. Pick it up a little bit if you're there. Nice work. Five, four, three, two, and one. All right, first exercise. We're gonna come down to the floor here in a bulldog or what I call a tabletop plank. Let me face you. Right here, and we're gonna tap those shoulders, okay? Three, two, and one. Hold, knees are just above the ground. You gotta draw the navel in towards the spine. This is good core strength here. Here we go. We're stabilizing the shoulders, our hips, so we're not rocking and twisting, all right? I want you squared off here as we tap. You can go elbows. You might reach over to your hands if it's a little hard. You might just hold it here. Okay, make sure that you keep a neutral spine, that you're not here. Get down that neutral spine. Three, two, and one. Let's walk it up. Uppercuts here, right out in front. I'm gonna go into a little mini squat here. If that bothers your knees, you stay high. Stay here through all this. You'll see me come down just a little bit into more of this athletic stance. If you can get there safely with the knees, do it. Kinda helps us build a good base and tight core here but it's okay to stay high, it's fine. I'm short, I might have to get high to get up under a chin. <laughs> All right, here you go, keep moving. Three, two, and one, we're back to the ground. We're gonna do a tricep dip here. We're gonna dip down, and when we come up and extend through the elbows, I want you to kick out, down and kick, all right? We have a halfway point on this, we're gonna go 30 seconds. We're gonna be on these triceps for a while, so do your best, but we're gonna go 30 seconds with our one leg and then we're gonna practice kicking out with the left leg. There you go, 10 more seconds here. 
Really extend through those elbows. Keep those shoulders down away from the ears and back. There you go. And switch. Left leg kicks out, extend. Come down, so you're kind of bent all over, right? Knees bent, elbows um, bent. And then we're gonna extend the knee and the elbows at the same time. So I always think about getting long and then crunching in. All right, try to figure out which direction you're moving here with the arms and the legs. So they bend and then the, the joints extend. Bend all your joints, extend. There you go, nice work. Woo, five seconds here. You're doing great, you made it through a minute of this. Three, two, and one. All right, we're coming up. Knee strikes here, but I want you to pull towards your hip, okay? Here we go. Bring that knee up, pull towards the hip. Really hit it hard and down. Good, that's it. Good. If you wanna bring it up a little higher, one, some of you can do little hops in there on that left foot, or we just pick up our pace, okay? For some of us that have knee issues, it's hard to get that heart rate up once you get conditioned without getting a lot of those large muscles of the legs. So we might have to work a little quicker, but when you're working quicker, switch sides, we wanna make sure that we're working with good form. I hope you're on that other side now. Same thing, you might feel a little different. There you go, come on. We're still thinking about bracing through our abs here, through our rib cage, through our transverse, abdominis across. We're drawing that navel in. We're nice and tight here. That's how we keep our balance. It's how we find power in that strike. Oh, that hit, okay? Three, two, and one. Rest. All right, I have us up, down, up, down. Let's come to the ground. Dynamic plank ups, all right? So find your low plank here, knees or toes. Right arm comes up, we do these a lot here. Right arm down, left arm up, left arm down. Turn to the side here. If you're on your knees, make sure those hips are down and level with the head, okay? So I'm not here doing this. Otherwise, I'm not pushing any of my body weight, okay? All right, now just switch the arm that leads you up and down. So my right arm pushes me up, it brings me down. My left arm's gonna bring me up, and it's gonna bring me down. All right, we're resting, or not resting, we're coming up. All right, we're gonna walk out and then just follow my lead. We're gonna come down into a walkout, all the way into a plank. Then we're gonna come back and we're gonna kick up. Kick up. Good, walk it back out. And walk it into a pike. Kick, kick. Good, out, in, kick, or rear lift is what I call it more. But it is a bit of a kick here, right? Three, two, and one. All right, nice work. Come up, grab a quick sip. We only have 10 seconds here again. We're going right into it. If you need more of a pause, pause now. All right, back to that bulldog shoulder taps. Come down to the floor, knees are hovering, neutral spine. Here we go, tap it out. Tap, tap. Good, nice and quick. Remember, we're trying to stay squared off with those hips and shoulders. We're trying not to really move anything but our arms. We're trying to stabilize the core here. Hips, abs, all through, our whole trunk. There you go. Woo! That's it. Knees are hovering. Three, two, and one. You can always hold those. All right, we're up with uppercuts. Here we go. Stay high here if you want. Pick it up if you need more. Bring it down if you can until those knees as long as those knees feel okay, all right? Some of us will be able to go lower. Just depends. Find out what works for you in there. Woo! There we go. Come on, hit it hard. You got it. Three, two, and one. Woo! All right. Tricep dips with the kick. 30 seconds each side here. Here we go, dip. Bend at the knee and the elbows, kick out. Extend at the elbows and knees. Dip, kick, dip, kick. You got it. Bend, extend, bend, extend. Good work. Keep going. Woo! Nice job. Oh, 30 seconds on the side. We have eight seconds. We're gonna switch. Hang in there. We're gonna feel the back. We're gonna feel our bat wings tomorrow. <laughs> All right, switch. Other way. Again, start bend, kick out and extend. Bend, extend. Or think dip, kick. Dip, kick, you got it. 
I find these little things, I say them a lot. Helps me stay on task and remember what I'm doing. Hopefully it helps you too. Woo, here we go. 10 seconds, you got it. Five seconds, three, two, and one. All right, we're gonna do knee strikes or knee hits here. Out to that hip, okay? Here we go. Hit, hit, hit hard. Bring it up quicker if you need to, okay? Woo, there you go. Quick, quick, quick. You got it. Woo. Oh, oh. Come on. Exhale with each hit. Contract your abs. Remember, we have 30 seconds on this side, 30 seconds on the opposite side. Three, two, one. Now switch. Here we go. Other side. Same thing. Pull towards that hip. Bring that knee up. Strike. I even bring my arm to my leg so I know that I get high enough here and I'm really pulling down and drawing up with that knee. Good job. You got it. Come on. High cardio today. We're gonna earn a little bit of rest here. Once we finish this circuit, three, two, and one. Rest, or not rest. We're going down, dynamic plank ups. I'll face you again for this. Here we go, right arm up, right arm down. You can do this from your knees. Left arm up, left arm down. Right arm up, right arm down. Left arm up, left arm down. The other thing you can do with this is bring it to an incline. If you have a bench, there, something higher up. You can do these at an incline just like you would a push up. It's fantastic. It's a great way to keep that core really engaged. Three, two, and one. Rest. Woo! Walk out. Let's start with our walkout. Get out here all the way extended. Come into a pike. Let's kick up, up. Nice work. Bring it out. Really squeeze your bottom during this, okay? Squeeze and lift. Squeeze, then lift, okay? Feel the glutes activate on this. Back in. Squeeze. Squeeze. Good. That's it. Out. In into a pike. There you go. Three, two, and one. Rest. 30 seconds is all I put in here today. I want to keep the heart rate elevated. If yours is too high and it hasn't come back down, and you need to bring it down, pause for a little longer. A minute, minute 30, but don't stray away. Don't get busy with home tours. All right, Woo. just 10 seconds, we're moving right. We're going into a jab, okay? Right foot forward, punch right, jab right. Here we go, three, two, and one. We have 30 seconds with the right arm, and then we're gonna go 30 seconds with the left. That's it, Woo. come on. Feels good. Usually in my kicks, kickboxing workouts, I put a little less punching and a lot more kicking and leg stuff. But because we're being friendly on these joints today, we're gonna do more punching, okay? <laughs> so just get ready for it. It still brings up the heart rate. Just work quicker, okay? To make it more intense if you need it to be. All right, halfway, switch. Here we go, left arm. Ooh, there you go. We're gonna move with this later. We're gonna take a double jabs. We're gonna mix it up, but we'll start here today. Good, keep going. Right out in front. It's quick return, okay? So don't stay out there, quick. There you go. Woo! We'll actually go into that double jab next, so we're gonna add a little step to this one here. In three, two, one. All right, so it's gonna look like this. Step forward, jab, jab, slide back. Step forward, jab, jab, slide back. Here we go. Step forward, jab, jab, slide back. Step, jab, jab, slide back. There you go. And forward, you can pick up the pace. Here you go, one, two, slide back. One, two, slide back. I feel like I'm dancing, here we go. <laughs> Keep moving. You're like, Tatum, that's not dancing. Well, I can't dance, so this feels good. <laughs> All right, five seconds. Three, two, and one. Other side, here we go. Jab, jab, slide back, step, and jab, slide. One, two, slide. One, two, slide. One, two, slide. You got it. Woo, that's it. We're going into kicks next. That's it, hang up, hang in here with me. 10 seconds. 
Good. Feeling strong, feeling good. This is kind of stress relief type of workout today. Three, two, and one. All right, here we go. We're gonna hinge at the hips and come up and kick. A lot of balance in this. So if you need a wall, you can hinge and kick here, okay? And you might just kick with the right leg. Maybe that's just where we need to be today without that hinge, because there's a lot of balance in here, okay? A lot of balance to step back with that hinge at the hips, pushing the hips back, and then up in front. Whew, there you go. We have to draw in, we have to brace here through our core to find that balance, to move from this position onto one leg with that kick in front. All right, but you can hold onto a wall to get there. Halfway, other side. Here we go, hinge, kick, hinge, kick out in front. That's it, think about hitting with your shoelaces. Whew, all right. Pretend there's something there, you're gonna hit with the shoelaces, kind of point that toe. Boom, that's it. Again, balance isn't there, take it here. Kick and just practice getting that foot off the floor and balancing on that one leg. You got it, it's all good work. Whew. Three, two, and one, rest. <laughs> all right, now we're gonna do high kicks and we're gonna alternate Whew. right out in front, okay? So step stay with one side for 30 seconds, keep it going here now. I'm trying to lean back, engage my core, get as high as I possibly can with these tight hamstrings. If you want, take it low, boom. You might just kick with more of a straight leg up down here to move a little quicker if we can't get to this point, okay? It's okay, find what works for you. Woo, all right. We're gonna do a rolling crunch with a cross punch here. We've done rolling crunches in here before. They're a favorite. You're gonna come back, come up, cross, cross. Back, rolling and crossing. If rolling is too much, you can sit up and cross. A couple options is to stay low and turn here. All right, you can still cross here with that back low to protect it. Some people, tailbone hurts, the lower back gets in there too much. When we come up into this V-sit, don't sacrifice that lower back. Any kind of pain, stop doing it. All right, here we go, more kicking. I want you to step, kick, back, okay? So I bring that right in, right leg in to meet the left, and then I kick, step it back. Kick, step. Good, there you go. We'll do both sides. Pick a side, we'll get both. There you go, whew. Nice work. That's it. You can speed it up a little if you want. So big kick. All right, halfway, other side. Step, kick, so left leg out, steps into the right, and then kick. So that left leg is kind of swinging in, tapping that, doesn't really tap, it comes into that leg and sends it out. There you go. All right, move at your pace. You can uh, speed it up just a bit. Step, kick, step, kick, good. That's it, nice work. Woo, good. Three, two, and one. All right, we're going back to the jabs, okay? Right side, then left side. One more round, do this. My next circuit, we're gonna do three rounds. Grab a quick sip, five seconds. Three, two, and one. Here we go, jab, right arm. That's it. <sighs> quick, that's it. See how quick you can work. You can work quicker if you tighten that core. Amazingly enough, <laughs> everything happens from that core, okay? If I'm loose, I'm gonna find it hard to find the, the speed, okay? Good. Woo, three, two, and one. Switch sides, here we go, left. There you go. This is good, good stress relief, right? <laughs> Slamming, kicking, punching. Don't take it out on your friends and your family. Just do a workout. <laughs> I promise it helps. Jab, jab, come on, quick, quicker. Woo, that's it, tighten up the core. See how quick you can go. Nice and sturdy, nice and powerful. Three, two, one. All right, nice work. Woo. All right, back to that right side. We're gonna step forward, jab, jab, and then we're gonna slide back. Step, jab, jab, slide. Step, jab, jab, slide. That's all it is. All right, so double jab, get back. 
back, back, good, come on, yes, that's it, you got it, woo! Good job, five more seconds, we're gonna switch sides. Switch, here we go. Double jab, slide, double jab, slide. Boom, boom, good, that's it. Have some fun with it. That's it, good. One, two, come on. One, two, and back. One, two, keep moving, don't stop. You got it, three, two, one. All right, hinge to kick, okay? Hinge and step back to kick. If you need to, maybe you're just here, kick. Little kick stand instead of reaching back. Still on this leg, just with a little toe here to help you. There's lots of options in this. Good. Make sure you're like a tipping, kind of like a little tipping bird, sipping water, that the body, the head, and the body and the spine tip together here, okay? I was looking up for a while there. I don't want you here. All right, bring that head down. Halfway, other side, here we go. Almost there, you got it. Ooh. Notice how I move my arms, where my left arm is uh, across from my right leg, my right arm across from that left leg. Here you go. Good. Now don't speed it up if you don't have the balance. Slow it down, get the balance, practice balance. Three, two, one. Woo! All right, alternating kicks. Here we go, up, in front here. As high as you can get it, don't worry if it's not that high. If you're kicking here, you're moving, okay? I get the paddles out for my clients, we do low. At first we might just go here, just kicking. Then we might come up here and kick. All right, we might really lean and kick. You do you, find your challenge. Always modify, three, two, and one. All right, rolling crunch, crossover punch. Three, two, and one, here we go, cross. Good, with a rolling crunch, hoo hoo. All right, you could even do a curl up. If that feels better on that back, curl up. Just make sure you roll down with some core strength there, okay? Or stay low and just do a little crossover with that lower back on the floor, just more of a crunch. Protect that lower back. Three, two, and one. All right, side step to kick, here we go. So we're gonna step it in, kick, and back. In, kick, back, good, there you go. And you can speed it up. All right, kick, get back. Bring it in, get back. Good, that's it. Good, that's it. Focus. Eight more seconds, we're gonna switch sides. Good. And time, good. Other side, left foot steps into the right. Kick, bring it back. Kick, that's it. Block that face. Bring the arms up, have them high. Tighten that core. Good. That's it. Come on. Get in there. Hang on to it. I just picture myself in an action movie. Can't stop, right? Gotta keep going. <laughs> oh, all right, 30 seconds rest here. Grab a quick sip, we're onto our last circuit. It's going quick. Three rounds though this time, so heart rate's gonna raise, but feel free to just take it too. Maybe you're short on time. Maybe that heart rate's starting to spiral on you. When you're just getting started, don't overdo it. Do what you can, not what you can't. I just heard somebody say that this morning. Do what you can, not what you can't. So if you need to stop, it's okay. All right, cross, one, two, upper, upper, okay? So cross, upper, upper. Got it? Cross, upper, upper. Hoo, hoo, uh, uh. There you go. One, two, one, two. Good. Nice work. And you can go as fast as you want. 
Good, right, keep it going. Still 30 second intervals. We're just gonna do th three rounds today on this one. All right, now we're squatting a little bit in there, but you don't need to squat, remember that. All right, we're gonna shuttle and jab. So here we go. Jab, jab, jab. I'm gonna go this angle and then bring it back, okay? So step, jab, jab, jab. One, two, three. Jab, jab, jab. One, two, three, okay, you got it? You can do two, you can do three, you can do four, whatever feels right for you. Find your little count there. All right, halfway, other side, here we go. Forward, 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 back, 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 okay? Forward, 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 back, 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 you got it. One, two, three, get back. Good, one, two, three, get back. One, two, three, get back. Woo, one, two, three, get back. You're doing awesome. Feels good, doesn't it? We're really moving on this one. Three, two, and one. And I'm kind of hopping in there, remember, just step it out. All right, this is where you might want the wall. Here we go up with this. We're gonna do a little, a little kick here, a little karate kick. <laughs> I'm not even sure if that's the right term, I'll be quite honest, but we're gonna just keep that knee up there. You might have to hold onto the wall to do this. And just kick out, extend from the knee. That's it. If you can, balance. Find your balance. Five seconds. Three, two, and one. Other side, here we go. Get the knee up there. Keep it level with that foot as we kick out from the knee. That's it, see if you can balance. I'm gonna keep my hand right here in case I lose balance. Woo, that's it. Come on, I'm losing balance. I'm gonna hold on, here we go. Keep it going. You got it, you got it. Try to let go where you can. Whew. Three, two, and one. Nice work. All right, alternating kits, okay? Oh, back kick, we're gonna kick back, here we go. Sorry, my brain, the oxygen is leaving. Kick back, okay, right here. You don't have to bend too much, give it a turn. You can hold on to a wall here if that helps, or a chair. We're gonna just turn and kick, turn and kick. That's it, look over that shoulder. Look at where you're kicking. Look at your target, tree, <laughs> garage door. <laughs> there we go, nice work. All right, here we go. Step, we're gonna step over. We're gonna do a high punch, like a head to body, okay? Step, head, body. Step, head, body. Step, head, body, good. Up, down, just like that. Some of you wanna go low and the knees are okay. Go high, go low, all right? We won't talk about where you're hitting there, but we're just gonna go head, body today. Head, body. All right. Alternating side kicks. Here we go. Side to side. Kind of like the one we did in the back. Uh, back here, alternating, okay? So we have to lean a little. If you want a chair here to hold on to, that could help. Good. No, I took a self-defense class and I made my girls and I made their friends take a self-defense class because they're, you know, starting to venture out on their own. I learned a lot, I learned a lot. I highly recommend you take one if you haven't. If you want to take one locally with me, let me know, I'll set it up. Not with me teaching it, but just with me and a group of people with a retired police officer doing it, actually. All right, we're back to the beginning, is that right? Yeah, here we go. We're gonna cross, cross, upper, upper, okay? Cross, cross, upper, upper. I'm gonna try to lead. This feels weird, it's not gonna look as pretty, but I'm gonna lead with my left. Last time I wanted to lead with my right, I'm gonna lead left. So left, cross, left, upper just to test myself, okay? Because sometimes we don't have a choice, right? We're gonna have to go with that. And, and it's hard, it's a, it's a brain-body connection that sometimes is off just a bit. All right, nice work. Shuttle jab, okay? So here we go, let's go left side. One, two, three, get back. Good, one, two, three, get back. Nice work, one, two, three, good. Look how my voice changed. <laughs> Three. Oh, who do I think I am? Here we go. Oh, I forgot to jump on that. I'm getting so excited about my voice there. All right, keep moving, keep moving. Come on. One, two, three, and back. Yes. One, two, three. Other side. Here we go. One, two, three, and back. Almost did a cross. If you want, you could add it in there. Cross 
and back. Let's do it for fun. Here we go. Jab, 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 cross, and back. That's a lot more fun. Jab, 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 cross. You don't have to change it. All right, keep working. Woo! Come on, one, two, three, cross. Nice work. One, two, three, cross. Woo! One, two, three. Three, two, and one. All right, here we go. Oh boy, back to those little karate kicks out here from the knee. You can hold on to the wall. I know I need to just a little bit. Trying not to though. I'm gonna try to hold it with my arms like this and stay here. Good, that's it, come on. If not, I can touch the wall if I lose balance and keep going. Woo, that's it, come on. Three, two, and one, other side. Here we go, one, two, come on. That's it. Woo, you got it, from the knee out. Try to keep that foot up there with the knee. Get it as high as you can for now. That's it. Woo. Now, if you're really having trouble with that, we could come down here. We could do more of a fire hydrant or a sidekick here from a quadruped position, which is also nice, okay, for the hips. All right, time. Options. <laughs> All right, alternating uh, back kicks. Here we go. Sorry. I'm trying to keep track of everything. Here we go. Kick back. You got it. Good work, reach. Whew. Look over that shoulder. You need to know where you want to plant that foot. Don't know what you're kicking if you don't see it. Woo, there you go. Oh yeah, feeling it. There you go, three, two, and one. All right, here we go. Step right for me. Punch high, punch kind of low, okay? Step. High, head, or body. Step, head, body. That's how I think of it, head, body. Head, body. For some of us who are tall, you're gonna be good. You might have to go <laughs> just out in front and low. For me, I gotta reach, okay? I gotta reach, body's easier. There we go. Three, two, and one. All right, alternate side kicks. One of my favorites, side to side. That's it, come on. Woo! 30 seconds here. We have one more round. If this is your stopping point, take it, okay? That's fine. I just wanted to bring it up a little bit here at the end because we're moving a little more. We kind of ease in with each round. I made them longer and longer. First one's a little shorter, eight minutes. A little, like 10 or something for that second. Take a quick sip. Last round. And then I wanted to bump this one up, so that's why we're doing it, but not all of us will be there. Go ahead and bring that heart rate down and stretch. All right, here we go. Cross, cross, upper, upper. All right, cross, cross, upper, upper. That's it. Move at your pace. And I'm gonna start, I'm gonna lead with this right arm. And in a few seconds, I'm gonna tell you to switch. I want you to lead with your other. All right, lead with your other. See how hard that is. That's why it's good to practice. Woo! Feel different? I know it does for me. I'm sure it looks different. I always use my dominant side to demonstrate anything, so you're seeing my weak side. <laughs> All right, here we go. Shuttle jabs. Jab, jab, jab. Let's do that cross. I like that. Jab, jab, back. Okay, oh no, we're not jabbing back. <laughs> here we go. And back, good. And forward. Cross, good, back. Jab, 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 cross. Get it back. There we go, jab, 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 cross, get back. You got it now, I've got it now. <laughs> Here we go. I'm getting tired, it's hard to think and move when you're tired. All right, nice work. Other side. Here we go, jab, 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 cross, get back. About three more. One, two, three, jab, cross, and back. Good, one, two, three, cross, and back. Keep moving, you got it. Say that to yourself, one, two, three, cross, back. And you've got it, Woo! And remember, I'm moving, I'm hopping a little bit here, but you can step, all right? You can, st one, two, three, cross. Don't think you have to hop and bounce around. All right, nice work. All right, here we go. Leg up, little fire hydrant here out to the side. Kick it. Try to find your balance if you're there. Whoop, I'm not there today, that's okay. It's been a long time since I've done this one. All right, 15, no, less than that. 10 seconds here on this side. 
Hold on to that wall if you need to. Or go down to the floor like I showed you, okay? Especially if you're getting tired. Three, two, and one. Tough one, right? Here we go. Anybody used to do uh, Billy Blaine's typos is what this reminds me of. All right, I'm pretty sure that's in one of his videos. Whew. There we go. Keep going. Kick it out. Find your balance. You gotta tighten up. You gotta squeeze the bottom. There you go. Come on. Ooh, you got it. Three, two, and one. <laughs> nice work. All right, alternating kickbacks. We got it. Now we're gonna really feel our glutes. I purposely did this. A lot of glute action there, hip action. Same here, okay? Ooh, feel it. It's good stuff. Good for core strength. Everybody wants a nice butt, but nobody realizes how, how important it is in helping us stay safe with our lower backs, our knees, everything. All right, step cross. Oh, hi, here we go. Step, hit head and body, right? Step, head, body. Step, head, body. Wherever that is for you, you might wanna go really low. You might wanna punch down. Whatever works for you, you do it today. Have fun with it, mix it up. Maybe you do three, you know what I mean? Just have fun. Do what comes naturally. Sometimes that's just the best way to go. Okay, so what would you do if you had two out there? All right, now last one, alternate side kicks. Here we go. Kick, yes. If you haven't been training with me, I'm never, I am here with you. Trust me, I'm here with you. But I'm always something in my head. So if we're boxing, I mean, I have an opponent, you know, like I'm working on it. I, someone is about to attack me. I'm in a movie, I'm a stunt double, double something. Every time, sometimes I'm a quarterback. Sometimes, oh, I'm a dancer. <sighs> cool down. Sometimes I'm, I don't know. I'm a lot of things in my head when I'm in here, okay? So just a, just a superhero. All right, woo, let's grab a sip of water before we cool down. I don't have a large um, stretch here today for you. I was trying to keep us within time. So if you need to stretch and cool down more, please take it. Just listen to some nice music. Usually I turn on something soft. Let's breathe first though, shall we? In overhead, in through your nose, out through your mouth. Good. Into your nose, out through your mouth. In through your nose, out through your mouth. I got a good sweat on, I don't know about you. I know we had that request for low impact. It does not disappoint ever. Here we go, in and out. In and out. Bring that left arm across the body here. Bring the shoulders away from the ears. Work them down. Hug yourself. Give yourself a hug. Give you a pat. Good job. Good job. You did it. You made it. Another one in the books, okay? And I want to talk about this. Um, if you're just getting started or restarting, um, or maybe you've been doing this, but you haven't really been on the kind of oh track you want to be on, it's a good time to start over. Just know that any journey, and again, I got some inspiration this morning. Let's switch arms. Any journey, any journey takes time, all right? There are quick fi fixes out there, okay? There are, but that's what it is. You don't really learn how to live life and obtain the goals you want if you do a quick fix, all right? You're gonna have a quick fix and you're gonna go back to your old habits, more than likely. Not always, but so just know that it takes time. We can have good days and bad days. Life happens, right? <laughs> Let's reach behind, interlace those fingers. If you're not there too tight, please let me know. I have a video I'll send you to loosen up that upper body, but also grab a towel like this and take it a little wider. This can help. Anyways, I just wanna say, please, and I have a client that has been so good about this. She used to be an all or nothing. Give it one or two weeks, full force, you know, give up all kinds of foods, uh, work, 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 and then just burn out, die out, and be done with it all together and go way extreme the opposite way, right? Like, I'm just gonna eat whatever, I don't care, this isn't working. Uh, don't do that, take it day by day, know that it's a journey. You might have two great weeks, you might have a week that stinks, that happens. 
Uh, let's see, what else do we wanna do? Let's bring that, we don't have much time. Let's uh, bring the right leg over and we're just gonna go down here. Bring, so right leg goes over left, hips go right, just so you know, and we're gonna slide left. Anyways, I just wanna say, take your time, do baby steps, okay? So I know I have like three to four workouts posting a week. That might not be for you, do two. Allow two days of recovery in between. Get two in for me, okay? Start there. Um, I have a lot of 10 minutes going up now. Maybe 10 minutes is all you have to give a day. I know they're not real popular. Let's switch left foot over right. I'm gonna take you over just a minute because I'm uh, wanting to talk. Uh, hips left, slide right. Um, I have the 10 minutes and that's there for a purpose because I don't want you to just write your days off. Um, and maybe you don't wanna do the workout, but maybe you wanna work on steps, just getting 10,000 steps in or maybe it's less than that. Maybe you only get 3,000 a day and you're gonna work at 5,000. And then you start to get 5,000, it feels easy and you realize you can do seven. Build up, don't go extreme. Give yourself time. Baby steps are better. I like baby steps because I love to challenge myself, but I also like to win at it, right? <laughs> I really, really need to win at it. So just make sure, like my running, I haven't been able to run. It's been really sad for me. I'm not where I was and I always wanna go out where I was and it feels bad. I was very proud of myself, I got up today. I just watched a movie, I took it easy. It felt good, it felt like I wanted to do it and I wanted to do it longer. So that's what you want. You wanna reel it back, feel like you wanna do it, you don't wanna dread it, you don't wanna hate it, find something you love, stick with it, okay? And ease in, take baby steps and know that you'll have the off days, just work your way back. And all these little changes keep increasing and, and you know, with, within a year, hopefully going into the next year, you will feel better, all right? And you'll have made some changes. All right, that's it. I'm gonna talk a talk. I was motivated this morning by a doctor I was listening to, but anyways, that's it. I will see you next time. Thank you for joining me. Remember to click the bell, subscribe, tell a friend to tell a friend. We need your help to keep this going and thank you so much. Bye-bye.